and they will never be forgotten. That was the message at a special memorial service in Upper Marlboro this morning. The Sheriff's Office and the Fraternal Order of Police Lodge 112 honoring the lives of fallen Sheriff's Sergeant James Arnod and Deputy First Class Elizabeth Magruder. Magruder's son, Devin, who was three years old at the time of his mother's death, is all grown up now, as you can see, and said to graduate from Sabbatsville High next Tuesday. Today, members of the FOP awarded him with a $5,000 scholarship. I want to say thank you to the sheriff's office. I feel blessed, but I wish it would have come in this way in my mother's death. Um, for them to think of her every day with a memorial, I want to thank them again. You know, I can't ask for much more. I just uh, am so proud of not only Devin and his accomplishments, but of his father, who's done an outstanding job of raising a young man who is now headed off to college. It's important for us to, you know, to sort of put a human face on policing, and I think ceremonies like uh, today does that. Uh, when we're able to bring back in family members, everybody's lost someone, and so when we're able to bring back in their family members, we're able to humanize this profession, and so that maybe the community can see us as one of them. Arnott and Magruder are the only deputies to die in the line of duty in the department's 320-year history.